Okay, let's create a new club. Singles part two. Need children, thanks. Hello everyone, my name is Gabby. I'm newer to The Sims and I have some good news, bad news, and some good-ish news. Let's start with the bad news. I already filmed an hour worth of footage for the 100 baby challenge and somehow the file was corrupted. The good news is that nobody missed anything, really. Basically what happened is Derek came back from school. He made a friend named Imran and Imran came over to hang out with him. Other than that, I mean, we worked on Lucas skill. He has some potty done, I believe. It wasn't anything too crazy. You haven't missed much, okay? And the good news is, as you can see, we're in a different room. So I now have like an office space where I can film more. And let me remind you to like and subscribe, comment down below your baby name suggestions because I do pick them from the comments down below. And let's hop into the game. Let's take a look and see what's going on with everybody. Derek does not have school today. He's a C student. Everything is completed, so that's looking good. Let's look at Luca, what's going on with him. He still needs potty level three. He's almost at imagination level three, and I think we're gonna work on our thinking. We have Noah over here. He did get a few milestones, so he learned to reach. He lifted his head. I gave him his first, actually, I guess more happened than I thought. Um, but this is what happened. You guys know the drill. You know how this goes. You didn't miss too much, okay? For our girl, Miss Nora, she's currently asleep. Oh my gosh, she's lovelorn because she is a romantic sim and she needs to show love and have it shown to her. We're giving birth in question mark, question mark. So I could open this up and we could be giving birth. This is scary for me. Have you noticed I cleaned up the bathroom and I got us a shower tub combo. We needed it, okay? We have money now. We can definitely afford one. Let's have Derek use the bathroom. He can honestly have the rest of the spaghetti. Little Luca seems like he's fine. I got him a wablet, wabbit tablet. I was splurging last episode, but let's make him play Sim Shape. Who is this? Does anybody know him? Kiyoshi Idu. I'm trying to sleep. We need to give Nora like a day to herself soon. Just F the rules and give her a day to herself. She deserves it. She really does. Okay, that's enough sleep, Nora. Can you please wake up? She's tense. How about we get on the move? We need to start with Marcus. And honestly, I think we need a new club. Okay, let's create a new club. Singles part two. Need children, thanks. That way we're telling them, we're letting them know, like we need kids, like they already know what they're in here for. We're not hurting anybody's feelings, you know? Let's add some requirements. They need to be a young adult or an adult. We need to do marital status, not married. That's all we need. Let's add some Sims to this club. How do we know this person, Ren? Okay, we're gonna add Ren just because we know him a little. Um, we're also gonna add Travis Scott, Simeon, Silver Sweater. Oh, Gerald. Hi, Gerald. We need a new photo. What should our new photo be? We can do this one. Singles part two. There we go. Now we have part two. Let's go back to singles. Let's get this going. I'm going to chat to Marcus, send him a text. Maybe we should go on a date. You know, it's the weekend. Why not? We'll have a babysitter. We're allowed to leave. Okay. Okay. She got off the phone. Oh, it begins. Nothing beats the feeling of crushing that final boss level. Whenever Derek is gaming, Derek is as one with the universe. Is it safe to say he likes video gaming? Sure. Go ahead. Love it. Who is this person taking photos? Let's just have a friendly introduction. Why not? If you're just going to show up here, then we might as well. Okay, they're chatting. All right, she's talking about the vacuum. You know, maybe... Are you single, man? I gotta look up this man. Hold on. Paolo Roca. All right, so apparently Paolo is uh, roommates with Marcus Flex, so I'm just gonna brighten his day and then send him home because apparently he's married. I mean, that's what Google is saying. I'm pretty sure. Goodbye. It was nice meeting you. Thank you so much. Um, I'm gonna give birth really soon and my son just broke the computer, so you need to go. Where do you think you're going, Derek? He's gonna go make a mess? No, no, no. You are actually not gonna do that. How about you just go practice your violin? Wouldn't that be better than making a mess, Derek? Nope, because Jules is here. Send home. Okay, we fixed the computer. That's good. Now, how about you invite someone else over? She has a good compatibility with Marcus Flex. I don't see why it wouldn't work. So let's send him a happy text. Marcus Flex, I agree, Nora. It's a great day. Let's go out and enjoy the day. You know what? 
I am leaving to go on a date with Marcus Flex. Luca and Noah have been sent to daycare. They're in good hands. Great. Let's just have a friendly introduction. Go ahead. Hi, Marcus Flex. I am about to have my baby very soon, actually. Oh my God, I can already kiss his hands and offer him a rose. Let's brag about our baby. Let's compliment his outfit, um, brighten his day. On sentiment gain, you make my day so much better. Thanks for making me smile. They're hitting it off. I kind of want to get to know him a little. We haven't really got to know many of our men anymore. So let's ask him about his career. Let's just get to know him. Salim is calling us. It's good to hear your voice, Nora. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Dominic Fires a little better as a friend. They seem like good company. I think you should go for it. Why not? Make some friends. Stop calling us. Oh, he's unemployed? Just like us. Discuss our interests together. Why are you running away? She's getting in line. There's a line for the bathroom. Use the bathroom and then come out here and get to know this man. You only have a little bit of energy left. We need to chit chat. Ask about day. Tell an engaging story. Ask about his taste in music. Go. You are not tired. Nora, it is only 3 p.m. Okay, okay. You guys get to chatting. Let's start flirting this man up. He dislikes hip hop music. Okay, Marcus. <gasps> We're in labor, Marcus. We're in labor, Marcus. We have to go. Let's go ahead and have this baby at the hospital. We try this every time, but let's go ahead and call Salim and see if he's going to come with us. He probably won't. He literally probably won't. All right, everybody. We're here at the hospital. Oh my gosh, Salim came. He came with us to the hospital. No other guy in our baby challenge so far has been here. I know, it's crazy. We're gonna have our baby. I'm probably going to pass out. Is he leaving? He's leaving. Okay, great. Well, goodbye, Salim. Thank you for absolutely nothing. Let's go here. We need to check in right now. Is there anybody here in this godforsaken hospital? Okay, thank you, ma'am. Where's she going? Do not go watch TV right now. We need to check in. Check in at the front desk, Nora. Look at her. She's like, I don't care about this. I wanna watch TV. Thank you, can I please check in? Oh, our needs are fixed. Okay, that's good. Something's working. Um, I'm gonna go have my baby. At least her needs are all fixed. Remember, it wasn't working before, which was not fun. All right, all right, here we go. Is there a doctor? Yes, there is. Oh my gosh, that's how we know him. You're in our singles club. You're gonna be a part of this, sir. Thank you. This is your future. Give us the baby, please. Come on, Ren. It's a boy, another boy, you guys, another boy. We're only having boys. Is this weird? All right, so the name I'm picking from the comments is Xander. So this is little Xander. I always say little everything. I, I can't help myself. Well, we're very happy. So let's go meet Xander. Hello, Xander. Oh, Xander, you're so teeny. You're so teeny. Okay, I'm thinking we go home and we get this party started with Marcus Flex. She is just a trooper. Look at her walking. She looks uncomfortable. I hope she's doing okay. We have a new little tiny over here. His name is Xander. Let's get pregnant. She's gonna call him over. Marcus invites to hang out and then she's gonna have leftovers. And for our little guy over here, he's hungry as well. What can he have? I'm gonna put this down. You need to grab a serving and then I need him in the imagination tent. Thank you for coming over so quickly. Why isn't he coming inside? Marcus is flirting with someone outside and you know, I'm not happy about that. She's just taking photos of him. It's so weird. Okay, okay, we got Luca at imagination level three. I'm going to have him go potty and then go potty and then go potty and then go potty. Marcus, come inside, Marcus. Quirk revealed, self-soother. Noah will often try to self-soothe himself. Infants with the self-soother quirk are more likely to place their little fingers and toes in their mouths to calm themselves when sad or angry. And especially when crying, they will also self-soothe. They will also self, why can't I say that? They will also self-soothe to fall asleep. God, that was, that was a tough one. Where's he going? Look at him, he's just walking around our house. Like, let's go inside. Like, let's go sit and chat here. All right, let's go. What, Derek, why don't you go draw? Okay, we're, we're going inside, finally. We're finally doing it. All right, Marcus, let's start this romance. Let's get this going. Let's compliment his parents. You know, we're gonna give him a heartfelt compliment. We're gonna ask about his romantic interests, ask a risque question. What's going on over here? Are you pottying your face off? 
and you're doing a phenomenal job. Okay, okay. Derek has reached level five of the creativity skill. He's killing it. How are these two people doing over here? Oh, we're flirty. That's good. Show off muscles. He, he's going to love that. Let's keep going. Bold pickup line. We're feeling very confident. Every moment of this, she's loving. Where's our son? Is he going to sleep at 8 p.m.? How about you just like wash your hands a few times before you go to bed to get that hygiene up? So get out of bed. Marcus is single. Perfect, Marcus. I love that. Let's tell him a dramatic story. I think he's into her. We're going to give him a massage. Let's see if we can start being a little affectionate. Look deeply into eyes. Okay, he liked that. He liked that. Oh, he's loving us right now. Do not go hold your baby. We are on a mission. Let's embrace. Let's kiss his hands. Okay, this is going really well. I'm actually really proud of this. Ooh, let's do some physical intimacy. All right, all right. Are you ready? Let's have a first kiss. Let's do it. All right, Marcus, we're holding your hands. We're being very polite. We're in our hospital gown. <gasps> yes, we did it. We did it. We slayed it. All right, all right. We're really flirty right now. So let's keep flirting with him though. Offer him a rose. Stop going to check on the baby. Let's go try for baby. Go, go, go. Okay, okay, here they go. Let's try for a baby. Go, Nora, go. Oh my gosh. Everyone is freaking out. It's not my problem. We have bigger fish to fry. We got little Luca running amok. What's going on here? He wants to go splash in the toilet. That's not happening. How about instead, get this, go to sleep. Are we done here or is it still going? Actually, since you're up, you can meet your new sibling and then maybe entertain and then maybe sing a song. Thank you. All right, Nora, now that you're done here, take a pregnancy test, please. He's going to bed in our house. That's fine. Oh, he is angry. He just met a sibling he does not want at all. Okay, that's great. Luca, that is not nice. Okay, we're eating for two, we're eating for two, we're expecting perfect. All right, Nora, we need to take care of our kids. So find out what's wrong and then what's going on with him? Oh my gosh, he's starving. And then you need to bottle feed him. All right, priorities, people, let's go. She's gonna go give him the big news and then she's gonna do what needs to be done. Hey, Marcus, we're having a baby. Okay, bye. Here she goes with this nonsense. We're gonna get our babies taken away. She keeps like picking him up and then putting him down. I don't know why. She always does this. It gives me anxiety. Let's check him and then we will help with needs. Okay, maybe she's gonna feed him. There you go, thank you. Now, Luca is running around at midnight. He's gonna go kick his brother. That's not very nice. You go to bed. Okay, we got one kiddo, good to go. How about you put Noah to sleep there? And now for our little tiny over here, he's been crying for so long. Let's help him with his needs. Good night. Good night. Go to bed. I love you. Okay. Mom's got to go to bed now. Xander is very hungry. Without feeding soon, this baby will be taken away. Okay. We're taking care of him. Help with his needs. How is he doing now? Hold on. Pause. She just loves to run off. Let's feed him. Let's breastfeed him. And then we are going to change his dirty diaper. It's 1 a.m. Are you kidding me? At least we're pregnant. That's good. She's parenting level seven, okay? Nora can now more effectively solve her kids' motives. She also can more effectively influence her children to perform certain actions. Well, that's good. How about, Nora, you go to bed immediately? Go to sleep. It's been a long day. You go ahead. I'll take care of the diaper. All right, here we have it. All right, everyone, we did everything we needed to do. We have a new baby and that's all I have for you today. So I'll see you in the next video.